Hey guys! What's up? It is the... Fourth today. And I got my bike today. Or my scooter, whatever. And if you've not seen a picture of it yet, here's a picture of it. I'm just in love with it. I have to drive it back from the shop today. And scary thing actually, it broke down on me. Yeah, it broke down first first time driving and it broke down halfway home. So well what had happened is I could see that right, let me just fill you in first. Firstly, we thought it had an oil leak. So it got sorted. There wasn't an oil leak, it was just a spillage. But they had given us a free bottle of oil under the seat for the concern. It was supposed to come with a full tank of petrol as well. Firstly, it did not have a full tank of petrol with it. Secondly, it did not have a full tank of oil like it was supposed to also have. I forgot to mention that before. So it had basically empty. It was literally just on the empty line, just a little bit above. And I was driving quite a distance. Um, about 20 minutes in a car, about 25, 30 minutes on a bike or a scooter. And I was driving basically with nothing. No petrol. Then I, um, there's like a, when you come in into my town out of like the road, the, the, the main road from where I got the bike from, um, it's on a hill and then you get to the top and you obviously go back down. But I got to the top and then all of a sudden it was like glug 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 glug. Then the speed just went dramatically down and then I just came to a halt. I had cars behind me so I had to pull over to the side, let them overtake. Then um, then the scary thing was is I forgot how to start it because it was obviously my first day on the bike. I'd only started it once which was to get out of the shop. But it was scary. Hmm. Sorry about that. Sure. <laughs> hmm. But yeah, I forgot how to start it. I was I was pressing the starting button and it's like it's not starting, it's not starting. Then I remembered I had to calm myself down. I had to hold the brake, then I had to start it and then it actually worked. And then but the good thing is my mum and dad were driving in the car. But like they'd overtaken me, then they'd pull into a lay by, then they'd wait for me to go past, and then they'd go and they'd overtake me, but they'd just overtaken me and they were waiting in the next lay by. And um I didn't think to say anything. So I got half I got basically home. It was like the last hill before I get to the top of it and then I come down towards mine and then I just got my little hill. But um I got to the top of that and then I, was, then I pulled over. This time my mum and dad were behind me. I just pulled over the side of the road because the, the petrol light was flashing like mad. Um, and my mum and dad stopped and they were like, what's up, what's up? I was like, I need to go back to get some petrol. Um, but they were like, well it should already have petrol. I was like, well it doesn't, so I need to go back to the, get some petrol. So we went to the petrol station and it cost me £2.75 to fill from empty. <laughs> I just thought that was so funny. £2.75. That's just... It's just crazy. And then... Um, then I got home and the oil light flashed. I was like, oh no, not another light. 
but so the oil light came on as well and my dad wasn't happy because obviously it was supposed to have a full tank of petrol and a full tank of oil and it had neither so luckily there was the oil under the seat that I was able to use so I used the oil and um, otherwise it's fine oh my eyes keep closing I'm tired So I've just been zooming around on my skewer, trying to get used to it. Um, I'm working tomorrow morning, so I get to go and show my friends at work. But I'm going to go like this video if you did, subscribe if you're not ready, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys!